You are watching Integration TV on YouTube, the very first English television show for Somalis around the world, where we connect and inspire everyday Somalis to come together and share their narratives. I hope that you take the time today to subscribe to our channel and to see the great work of many Somalis who are trailblazing, who are pioneers and change makers in our cultural shift. This is Integration TV, the first YouTube channel dedicated to the Somali narrative. Growing up in Canada, I had a really amazing childhood. I grew up with 11 siblings and my two parents in Canada. As a little girl, I loved experiencing a new society because I really didn't have a knowledge of Somalia or where we came from. I always was very interested in learning about my identity and where I come from. Like the story of many Somalis around the world, my parents kind of arrived in Canada and had to start their life over and they didn't really have this desire to talk about where they they came from because of the war because of all the problems so for me the big deal for me was when I started integration TV it was more about how do I connect with my roots how do I find other Somalis that are like me because you know I didn't really speak Somali growing up and I didn't really know the language so when I grew up and I became a woman and I had two kids I started thinking to myself what kind of life are they gonna have and that's when I started thinking about how do I create a medium that connects them and connects them to other other Somalis around the world. So when I started Integration TV, I thought the integration was about Somalis integrating to their new societies. But what I really realized was that Somalis needed kind of to integrate back to their culture and to learn about themselves. So yes, I think Somalis are doing well in their host countries around the world, considering that we fled a war-torn country, considering that we had to rebuild ourselves in 25 years, considering that we have many university graduates now around the world, and we have so many positive stories to share and depending on what you pay attention to that will be your opinion of how well Somalis are doing in the West. As an entrepreneur my working day starts off at approximately 4 in the morning where I practice daily habits of working hard and also prayer and then also preparing my children's lunches getting them ready for school and after I drop them off school it's off to running to produce my segments and to gather footage or just make a sales call and uh, to earn revenue to continue my dream. Part of the reason that Integration TV was born was also when I was going through a period of change in my life where I was getting to know myself again and what I was passionate about. As many of my viewers around the world know that when you go through different tragedies in life, you experience hardship and you have to kind of pluck your way out of it and get to know yourself again and through um, that experience I was able to learn about my passion to give back to society and sometimes in our worst pains we realize our greatest passions. Okay, take your time. Welcome back to Integration TV on Omni Television. I'm Hoden Nalea. So welcome to Integration TV. We are in Minneapolis enjoying the third anniversary of the Somali Museum of Minnesota. And look, all these Somalis are here having a good time recreating the Hollywood red carpet. Welcome to Integration TV on our YouTube channel. I'm Hoden Nalea. Welcome to Integration. I'm Hoden Nalea. This program serves to bring you stories that matter in our community and enhance our lives. Welcome back to Integration on our Let's Talk About a segment today. The first English television for Somalis around the world. I'm Hoden Nalea. Thank you so much for joining us today as we continue conversations that matter in our country and bring diverse communities together. You're watching Integration TV, connecting you to positive Somali stories around the world. Welcome to Integration TV, where we bring you exclusive events from around the world affecting Somali communities. Welcome back to Integration TV in Africa. I'm so happy to have finally come to Kilimanjaro.
On Integration TV, our YouTube channel, which is watched uh, now approximately by 3.5 million people around the world, we discuss different social topics. I travel around the world and meet different Somalis. Um, I connect Somalis through the power of the digital media. And basically, we share, we, we grow, we share success stories, which many of us have been deprived of, of over 25 years because we haven't seen many successful people in our community because of all the scatteredness that happened to us. One thing that I love about Somalia is definitely the people. I love traveling back to Somalia and discovering the beauty of the country that I never had a chance to grow up in. And what I really love is the authentic people that I meet, people who are genuine, who are sincere, who are kind, who welcome you with open arms and who invite you to their home and give you food and feed you based on this concept what we call Somali Nimo, people who welcome you, appreciate you, value. And I love the fact that my community back home and actually inside Somalia, um, they just appreciate you. They understand that, you know, when you're an authentic person, like when I go home, I don't pretend to be perfectly speaking Somali to know everything because for me, it's an actual journey. Like I'm not the same Somali person um, that grew up in Somalia would be, you know, so part of it is learning that journey and, and kind of seeing yourself as a tourist at the same time you're sharing a heritage with the people in the country and especially you know the Somalis that are what I call the the villagers the people that live outside the bigger cities they're just so kind so wonderful so welcoming and they carry some of the most authentic Somali way of life so I love that Put your ally by. Oh, total Bahana. Hi, you fat Makora. Manti, you want to eat the end? That's another responsibility. Yeah, exactly. So you have. Are you. Are you eating? Double O? Yeah. And No, we didn't know. That's no, we didn't know. Right? Right? I don't know what kind of catch words. Catch words. But isn't it? Am I right? So here's what I got from this whole story. Like, into the bottom. This is TV. It's supposed <laughs> to be fun. <laughs> One thing that I love about Somalia is definitely the nature. I love the beaches. I love meeting people that are amazing and resilient. And what I really love is the food. I mean, what other country has the best organic food than Somalia? I don't know. But I really love my country and I really love the people that I get to meet every time I travel there. So being a working mother, one of the hardest things is always balancing um, your work and your home activity. And many of that which includes cleaning and cooking. But one thing I've always take pride in is that my children come first and I love being home with my kids and what I love about this opportunity to do my dream is the fact that I'm able to have a flexible schedule so that I can go to my kids school at lunchtime, I can pick them up, I can enjoy dinner with my children, I can see them go to bed at night, um, which a lot of the luxuries if I was working at a major network I wouldn't be able to have that time with my children. So while my children are young I take pride that I'm able to balance my life as a mom, which is my first priority and duty, and then also to enjoy living my passion.
goal is to keep growing Integration TV and keep connecting Somalis around the world and keep sharing positive stories that uplift the spirit and inspire young Somalis around the world to take charge of their destinies. And I, inshallah, I hope that people around the world can join us, subscribe on YouTube and connect with us and to learn about positivity and how we can be better human beings every day and contribute back to ourselves and more importantly, back to our country.